don't jealous me. Hey, man. Guess who's back, 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 back again, again, again. T boy is back, back, back. Tell your friend, friend, friend. Yes, Bamboo T boy is back in the hood. Your African James Bond, forget 007. No, this one is 0017. Yes, 0017. We thank God. We're not in the year 2012. Happy New Year to all my fans in America, UK, Ghana, Nigeria, Poland, Ireland, Lee, um, Ghana, um, Chinese Lee, all your countries, all your lands. Happy New Year to all of you. I know the number one New Year's resolution has been, I want to lose weight and be very, very slim. You have been writing that New Year's resolution since 2002, 2012. Nothing is going to change. Are you a monkey? Eh? You this fat Herbert. All you know how to do is, is chop. I don't know, maybe your fridge is the one that's holding you hostage. It's holding your gunpowder and saying, eat me, eat me. Eh? That your belly is just doing double vision. Better go sort your life out. What a new year. But let's forget that one. Hey, I want people and my, my Twitter, Twitter buddies. Yesterday has been the funniest night of my life in a long time. In a what? Long time. It was hilarious, man. The conversation was all about what happens in an African house. For you people that are not on Twitter, maybe this will encourage you to go and get Twitter because that sh shit was popping off, man. Ask anybody that was there. It was too funny. The tweets were ridiculous. Like, stuff like that happens in the Nigerian house. For example, you know when your uncle, eh, you know when your mom tells you, ah, hey, one of your uncle, Uncle Sunday, is coming to stay with us for only one week, okay? So make sure the house is tidy. In your own head, you're thinking, okay, one week, that's nothing, I can ride that out. Uncle Sunday now comes with his face like that. Hello, how are you? Hey, I'm fine, thank you, Uncle. No, that's good. Nice to meet you. Nice to meet you, too. In my own head, I'm thinking, it's only one week, I can, I can handle this, no problem. Three years later, this man is still here with the same smelly mouth, smelly hand still coming into my room without my permission when I'm trying to get freaky. What is your business? Eh? What is your wahala? You have now become a product of the house. You said one week. It's now three years. Come on. I've done Happy New Year with you three times now. Go to your own house. Go and find your own rent. It just gets me so annoyed, so flabbergasted. One other thing that happens in an African house, I'm sure everybody has been through this experience. I was, my own experience, so I was, tired is not the word. I was just finished, more finished, girl. I was finished. I finished football practice, eh? And I came home. I just said, hello, mom, hello, dad. How are you? How are you, Tolu? Yeah, I'm fine, thank you. Bear in mind, they've already greeted me. Everything is fine. I now go to my room. Because I'm tired and weak, I just fall on my bed and just on my Blackberry. Yeah, babe, um, I just finished football practice. I was thinking about you as I scored that goal. Send. Oh, yeah, it's Tolu. <coughs> what, what is it now? Tolu, look where? Yes, mom. Yes, I'm sleeping. You are what? I'm sleeping. Shut up. Come downstairs here now and come and wash all the plates. Wait. <laughs> Hold up. Hold up. Just one minute. Did I participate in the chopping of the food for those plates? No. I even bought McDonald's so I don't have to wash anything. Eh? And you guys are making me just wash all these plates. Come on. I mean, come on. But the number one thing that annoys me in an African household is when your parents are trying to pronounce fast food places. Oh, you don't get it. Don't worry, you will get it. For example, in the United Kingdom, when you and your boys want to go and get food, you say, hey, yo, Bob, hey, come and go and get McDonald's, yeah? In America, you will say, hey, yo, shorty, what's up? What's up, player? Hey, let's go get some McDonald's. You understand, though? Um, McDonald's, McDonald's. In China, I don't know what you guys say. But in an African household, Tony Lokwe, go and buy your brother Madonna. Huh? Madonna. How? Madonna. Where have you ever seen that type of spelling like that? I don't get it. Where? That's what happens in the African household. I hope you enjoyed this video and happy new year to everybody. 
This year is going to be fantastic for all of us. And Mr. Don't Jealous Me is signing out. Shh, heads, man. Peace and love. And remember to follow me on Twitter.